Hi everyone, it's, it's me again. Welcome back to Life is Strange True Colors. Okay, we just left off from Gabe's um, proper send off with the lantern. And now I'm here to see. I think the rest of the story will now progress to finding out who or exactly what in Typhon. What exactly happened? From Typhon side. Also, I'm just gonna point out right now, Monster Moro, Chapter Three. Okay, I'm going to point out right now how very different it feels to have all the chapters of the game just right here instead of back then when you had to wait for the chapters to come by as they progressed. And what what's happening here? What's happening you here? You have a superpower. Yes! You're both fucking with me, right? Yes, we're telling her, finally. Not fucking with you. I wouldn't call it that. Do Ryan and I look like the fucking with you type? It's all true. Fine. Then tell me what I'm feeling right now. You're feeling disbelief. <laughs> it has to be intense. Be alright. You're actually a little annoyed. You feel hurt that we didn't tell you until now. Whether it's true or not, you don't like being left out. Down on the money? Well, okay. Yeah, okay, we got it. Oh shit. The foosball game. <laughs> he knew exactly what to do. Yeah, that was pretty much it, yeah. You needed it. You needed to focus on the positive memories, not get lost in the sadness. I thought it would help. It did. Did, did you just check just her out? Warn me next time, okay? Deal. Okay, okay. That's two people now. Never thought I'd have a freaky empath friend. Pretty wild. Pretty cool. So now so, it's three of us. Any sign of Diane today? No, but she was in yesterday working on her laptop. You said she was afraid of something around Gabe's death. If she's covering up what Typhon did, I bet there's proof. There's absolutely proof. So. If she comes in today, let's be ready with a plan. In the meantime, I've got to finish my shift. We're on it. Nice. Nice, 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 nice. Time to earn a paycheck. I should clean the dirty dishes around the bar. Look, uh, Jed, thank you so much for remembering my birthday last week and that Marco Esquanda tequila was excellent. You're welcome over anytime, your best cook by a long shot, Francisco. That's, that's neat. Um, so I guess we're not really doing anything. Jukebox. Let's see. Um, beer taps. Ah, Colorado tap water. Peanuts. I'm not convinced this is totally sanitary, but <laughs> what do I know? Hey, it's you! Contests even work. In your face, Ryan Lucan. I'm Birder of the Year, and your reign is finished. Uh-oh. Better not tell Ryan I had a hand in that. No, it would be so funny. Look. Now, Steph and Ryan know the big secret. It is such a relief having them in my corner. Hi, Jed. How are you? Can I check you? Okay, no, I guess I can't. Did you trade out the quarters in the register yet? All you, kid. Thank you. Oh, what are you afraid of? I can't go on a run. Everyone will see how awkward and out of shape I am. Forget it. Been there before. Maybe I can encourage her. Speak. Hey, can I ask you something? I've always felt too self-conscious to try running. You seem like a pro. Any tips? Oh, well, definitely don't let that stop you. Just push through it, you know? I'll try that. Thanks. I hope that helps. Trust me, you're not alone. 
Are you still the same? Okay. We won't be able to know. Let's clean. I mean, there was some leftovers there. Okay, Eleanor. Okay, hold on. One by one. Student. Oh. Where are you, girl from Rome? Gosh, I really miss that song. They used to play it in here all the time. Weird. I've never heard it. Maybe Jed knows where it went? Let's ask him. Hey, where do we keep unused jukebox CDs? We don't. Everything we have is in the jukebox. Oh, oh just curious. Okay. Girl from home. How, how will we know? Pick up the children, win them a perfect check brace. Mind the damp orange, cheek line transfer. Give me a hand, go daddy go. Heartstrings, hear a thousand rhymes, kiss up a shit. How are we supposed to know? Unfuck yourself. Are we just supposed to know wh which song that is? Um, because I don't know. I... I feel stupid. <laughs> I don't know. Maybe I can just ask her what the song is. Actually, I can ask Steph song. Yeah. Hey, do you guys know a song that goes, Where are you, girl from Rome? Holy shit. Blast from the past. Alabaster daydreams. My okay. dad used to love that song. Gabe would put it on repeat just to mess with him. Got to the point where he couldn't stand to even hear it anymore. Okay, thanks. So, what happened to it? Yeah, what did happen to it? Eventually, Jed pulled it out of the jukebox and stashed it somewhere. You could ask him. Oh. Sweet. Thanks. Okay, that's... Hey, boss. Do the words alabaster daydreams mean anything to you? It wasn't in the jukebox. Oh, hell. Like brother, like sister, huh? <laughs> Fine. Guess it's been long enough. It's back behind the bar someplace. Nice. Thanks. Thank you. Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Let's see. We're back behind the bar. Back behind the bar. There it is. Nice. All right. Let's hear this infamous song. Where is it? There it is. Alabaster Daydreams. Enter. <laughs> Alabaster Daydreams. That's it. How the hell? Don't worry about it. That's nice. Okay. Una momento, please. Okie dokie. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Continuing. Okay. Do we speak to you? How's it going? We have some ideas that are going to blow your mind. Well, let's not get ahead. Of course. Blow your mind. I don't doubt you. Oh, uh, back. Eleanor. Okay. I'm oh, sad. If I can get help on my own, Riley never needs to know about my condition. I won't have to be a burden. It oh. breaks my heart that she's coping with this alone. Hey, Eleanor. How are you? I'm doing okay. It's already been a few weeks, huh? Of course. I'm glad I could help. Okay. 
Oh, look at her little teapot. That's so cute. Okay. Um, that's 30 dishes. Wait. Let's see. This is some really nice tunes. Okay. Oh, Diane. Okay, so I'm just gonna quickly come back to this lit, um, later because it is 11 and I gotta go. So, jump cut. Pop. And we are back to Life is Strange True Colors. Uh, we, okay, I left for a few, actually a few hours. Crap, I already forgot. Shit. Oh, okay, we are at the tavern. We're back at the, we're back at the tavern. And we were doing stuff. Hmm. Okay, okay. We just finished cleaning some dishes and then Diane comes in. Okay, okay. She's here, she's here, okay. She's here, she's here. Hey, welcome. I'll be right with you. I better check in with Steph and Ryan. Don't tell me you're planning to do what I think you're going to do. Which is... Um... Steal okay. the laptop. She's here. What's the plan? Well... We have two plans, actually. Mm-hmm. But... We're still workshopping them. Two's good. Good to have options, right? So what are they? Okay. Okay. So here's what I'm thinking. I asked Diane out on a date. Wait, what? And she's so into it. She doesn't notice one Ryan Lucan swiping her laptop. Ryan carries said laptop upstairs, acquiring damning evidence. Maybe Diane and I still hook up? Not important. Oof. <laughs> That's your plan? I mean, it could work. Oh my god, please tell me you have something better. I do. Now to be clear, it's the same plan. Oh. Except, I'm the distraction. Look, Steph, I don't even think she's gay, alright? She's probably into the rugged mountain man type. All the transplants are. Excuse me? Let's keep workshop workshopping. <laughs> <laughs> okay, maybe these plans do need some more time. What? It's a simple plan, literally two steps. You just need to choose the hotter distraction. Oh, this is where you want me to okay, choose. I'm not doing that. You're the only tiebreaker we have. Oh no. <laughs> I honestly think I mean if there's anyone who can actually keep a distraction I think it's Steph Shit But if I choose Steph to distract Wait, can I still make my choice? Fuck. Oh no. Let's go with Steph. Badass DJ? It's a no-brainer. <laughs> Sorry, Ryan. Fuck yes. <laughs> In your face. Yeah, that's fair. Look. I appreciate the, uh, there's the, auto save. the effort, but we don't even know if she has anything worth stealing yet. I hope she can't hear you from all the way there. Talking to her. Maybe I can get her worked up and read her emotions. I'll let you know if I need that distraction. Okay. 
Let's see if we can do our mojo first before your usual. Thanks, Alex. We do anything else. What's the best way to rile her up? Help me for Gabe's sake. I know you're responsible. Let's go on straight? No. Let's try to pay, um, guilt trip her. You know all I want is justice for my brother. Please. Help me. Alex, I can assure you that Typhon is committed to a full and open investigation. Uh-huh, I've heard that same spiel. You want to find those responsible and hold them accountable just as much as you do. That's the truth. It could be possible that somebody else on top of her is also responsible. She's got a great poker face, unlike Mac. But let's see what she's really feeling. Let well, me try and read her first. Fear, of course. Poor Gabe. No one deserves to die like that. She said, if I keep her thinking about Gabe's death, maybe I can find out more. Cross, beer, sticker, napkins, photo, cross, sticker. William Bloom. Gabe loved him. I think he spent a whole year just listening to him. <laughs> really? He had good taste. Surprised we never talked about it. That was pure luck. Still fear? Okay. Photo? Oh, such a cute photo. My niece and nephew. They're adorable. That's a nice cross. Oh, thanks. Oh, there's more. Jesus. Typhon does a lot of local hiring, huh? We're always Indeed. growing. Uh-huh. What's this? The Black Lantern by Ethan Lampert. Huh. Are you joining in the LARP later? It's been so hard for Ethan. We're all hoping it will cheer him up. I can't. Good luck, though. I'm sure he'll appreciate it. Anything? He was practically a father to Ethan. And now he's gone. It's just so fucked up. I should have probably uh, looked at he when he said William Bloom. He was practically a father to Ethan. And now he's gone. It's just so fucked up. I bet you and Gabe threw back a lot of these together. He was a great bartender. Made the long work days more bearable. Okay. Now I need to pick something that will push Diane's emotions over the edge. Okay, let me just see what she's thinking now. Later, and I can still feel the void he left behind. It's already a month. Push over the edge. Very near and dear. Look, I know you're not a bad person. But my brother is dead because of the choices you and Typhon made. How does that make you feel? I actually want to know. Alex, I... Ducky is just sitting there by himself. Mm -hmm. Typhon is doing everything we can to address the situation. That's the truth. Okay? Now she's just sad instead of afraid. Alright. That's the emotion I was looking for. Time to explore Diane's guilt about Gabe. Let's go. Whoa, you're really digging in. What does it look like? Okay. Okay. 
time to find out what Diane is really hiding. All right. Hello? Hello? Miss Jacobs? It's Deputy Pike. Pike, I'm sorry, but we're very busy at the moment. There's been an accident. What kind of accident? Okay, she really didn't know. He came here looking for a better life, just like me. He's gone. I'm still here. Wait, there's something else. Oh? A USB drive? I can't undo what Typhon did, or the role I played. But at least I have everything I need to protect myself from them. Holy shit. She must have evidence on the USB stick. Oh, looks like I'll need a distraction after all. We should get their opinions first before doing anything. Or not, I guess. Maybe not. Okay. Here we go, here we go. Hey, Diane. Oh, hey, Steph. How are you? So, what's your deal? I'm sorry? Are you single, semi-single, taken, but still down to get drunk and make out? Whoa. Oof. <laughs> Was not expecting that at all. Um... <laughs> Am I blushing? I feel like I'm blushing. <laughs> it's working. <laughs> Big time. Yeah. I could see your cheeks from space. <laughs> Super. Real good look for me. I'm so flattered. I don't even know what to say. Hey, no, no sweat. Just think about it. Get back to me. I'm not going anywhere. Well, you could have. I think that would be more suspicious if you just left immediately. I wonder if they almost buy as well, or something of the notion. I don't know. That was a very cute moment but I know it's going to play very badly in the end or something that was supposed to save her that was supposed to save herself holy shit that was epic totally insane, insane. my heart is pounding <laughs> my goodness okay Steph, <laughs> you're all dorks there's a very real chance that you awoke something in Diane <laughs> Wouldn't be the first time. <laughs> that was hilarious. You guys. Oh, that was hilarious. Oh my god. I hope this was worth it. Okay, here we go, here we go. Okay. Password protected. Guess I'm not surprised. I'll bring this to Riley. See if she's willing to help. She's a whiz at computer stuff. Of course. Of course, that makes sense. In the meantime, we have a LARP to do. True. Yes, definitely. Grab your hat and meet me at the park. We have a hat. Don't forget your guitar, okay? We have a hat. Keep the hat. One question. When the LARP's over, can I keep the hat? Please? I'd say that all depends on how you do. Mm. Damn. Gauntlet thrown. Okay. Fair is fair. So, did you finish the thing? Yeah, barely. It took me all night. I haven't carved like that in ages. 
They're so sweet, All both right. of them. I need to grab my guitar and the hat that Steph got me. Who's that? Wow. Okay. Typhon officially clears Typhon of any wrongdoing in death of local man at the hands of Typhon explosions. The sheriff's department would like to provide a brief update regarding our ongoing investigation into the death of Gabe Chen. Mr. Chen's death has been officially ruled an accident. However, our investigation remains open. We encourage any members of the community who might have valuable information to step forward and share it with us. Our goal now is to gain a comprehensive understanding of the events that led to Mr. Chen's death in order to prevent further harm from befalling anyone in our community in the future. I mean, Jason is doing his best. If it was a rule an accident, why are you still investigating? Okay. Um... Let's see. Please don't make me disable comments. Black Lantern, we will be closed to regular business this afternoon in order to participate in Steph Gingrich's live action game. We'll see you all this evening at the park for the Spring Festival. <laughs> live action game? What? It's called the LARP Dad. <laughs> I knew that. I was testing you. Oh. Good morning, Haven Springs. The famous rose cart has been polished up and stocked with their finest. You can find it in the park at sundown. Pick, pick one up and present it to your spring festival sweetheart. Man, nobody's ever given me a rose at the spring festival. Uh, let's see. LARP volunteers, some of you still haven't synced up with me about your characters. Ooh, ducky is cool along full in character. Nice. Wait, should I read it? I should probably. I've written an extensive backstory from a character inspired in part of the sections of Wu Cheng's journey to the West. However, whenever I tried to include it in this application, I receive an error message to the effect that I've exceeded the character limit. Thoughts? Oh, okay, that makes sense. Uh, Typhoon Mining will be setting off charges tonight at 5 p.m. Yikes. Black Lantern. Best job I've ever had. I have no, that, that competition is super fierce. <laughs> Okie dokie, Stephen Rich, last call for LARPers. Hey y'all, decided to close my portrait commissions for the time being. I need to work for my backlog, sorry to disappoint. Okay, that's understandable. Uh, Jed. So many memories of Gabe I didn't get to make. Thank you to everyone who attended the Gabe Chen Memorial Service and a special show of gratitude to those who spoke. I think we did Gabe proud. Do you remember, remember the thing he used to do when he would get choked up because he was too embarrassed to admit it? I haven't cried since I was like 14. It's allergies. Don't look at me. I'm gonna miss him a <laughs> lot. Same. Yeah. Oh. Uh, and anything else here at the bottom? No. Okay. Last one is Steph. Let's see. Ducky is so into it. I'm in dire need of NPCs. Okay, are we gonna be an NPC or are we gonna be competing? Oh shit. We have a lot of texts. Riley. Uh, hey girl, thanks for the drink last night. Charlotte. Um, okay, I can't. I can't. Let's see. Ryan is rage. Ryan joy. Diane sadness. Eleanor fear. Okay. And whose memories? I missed another one of Jed. And two of Gabe. Shit. Pike. Damn it. Let's see. Take, Take the guitar. And then. Nice. Okay, let me grab my hat. Shushu. Can we bring Shushu? Nope. Let's see. Which outfit are we going to go to next? Hmm? If we're going to be a bard. Wait, no. That's the one that breaks the game, I think. Maybe? Let's stick to yellow. Yellow is fine. Character sheet. Wow. Steph is a rock star for putting this together. Let's see. Ethan is going to flip. We're here to have fun, don't hit too hard, go for arms, legs, torso, back, sides, front. Avoid hands, feet, neck, head. 
act stuff out. If you get hit, perform a grunt or injury. Thank you so much for doing this. It means a lot, Steph. Okay, that's nice. Oh, okay. Alvin, half F, Bard, health points, 10. Let's see, untuned, attacks untuned, what? Let's see, untuned cord, one damage, magic, healing serenade, one health to you and your allies. Steering him, double feigners, next attack, nice. Okay. Actually, we should probably look I at that again. I don't need to memorize this stuff. Do I? I mean, if we're going to support Feynor, let's see. Ooh, His Majesty's Summer Castle, Direwolf Den, Goldweather's Tavern, the Magpie Emporium, Spider Rift Alley, Dangerous Swamp Troll, River of Sorrows. Nice. And where's my hand? A chipmunk. Ducky's gift to me for finding his booze. It's um. <laughs> It's a unique expression of gratitude. It's very cute, that's what it is. Um, where... Laptop. Shrine. Oh, this is new. I don't even know if I'm doing this right, but... It felt like I had to do something. I found some really cute photos of Gabe and Ethan on this thing. Open. Chest. What's in this? Oh, the puzzle is clean now. Or it's it's not on the huh. desk anymore. There it is. A bard hat. Nice. You're so taking it. Oh shit. The feather on the hat must have fallen off. Maybe I can find it. Wait. Open. Oh, Gabe Gabe's Chen. last effects from the coroner. Pike dropped it off a few days ago. Guess I've been avoiding looking through it. Should you look through it right now? Okay. Ooh, nice. You can take the kid out of juvie. True. Okay, wallet, pickpockets, stuff, uh, compass with uh, keys, uh -huh. your hat, hurry up and finish your shift, love, charm. Oh, it's- One match left. I don't know why, but this must have been really special to Gabe. Oh. Never know when you'll need a light. I'm not giving up yet, Gabe. I better find that feather. Steph is a stickler for details. Isn't there something else in the chest? See secret beer, feather boa, look. Yeah. I don't need to know what that was for. He take Um Life in Haven would be a lot worse without these two weirdos. True, true. A housewarming gift from Eleanor. She said Gabe loved these little dudes. No sunglasses though. We're one step closer now. Corporate sabotage to do list. Why do you have that? I mean, I know why you have that, but that's physical. Steph, I will murder you. Alex, Steph told me you'd be willing to play at our next open mic night. I wager it'd really help loosen folks up and break the ice. Can you make it, Jet Black Lantern? Oh. <laughs> nice. Wish I'd taken Steph's advice. Ugh. Alex, thanks for the foosball game. I mean it. Also, only eat one of these at a time. Okie dokie. Feather, feather. Where are you, feather? Are you in the drawer? Why would you keep the key to that in the chest over there? That doesn't make sense. This must have been Gabe's. Makeshift right list. Oh. Find Alex, done. Find owner of stolen Chevy, done. Re reimburse Judge for free rent, done. Return Ernesto's Walkman, done. Donate to Lawrence Attention Center. Apologize to... I can't see. New bong for Kevin. Apologize to Zoe. Really apologize to Katya this time. Apologize to Ira and tell him you like, like his remixes. That 
It's a long list. And I bet he would have gotten through it. Apologize to Oscar. Pay Mr. Ma back for the Chevy. Apologize to the guy from the mall. Write thank you letter to Lenny. Mel checked to Mrs. Franks for the broken window. She moved to Maryland. Track her down. <laughs> Write to Miss Henry at Buckman High and tell her she was right. Forgive Dad. Aww. Wow, Gabe. Still finding ways to break my heart, huh? Oof. And you were just going to leave this entire apartment to her. Forgetting all about that. Are we? Are we? Are... To me, to wreck Gabe's bike on my first ride. Oh, you At wrecked least it. Ryan had a good laugh about it. Is the feather not here? Is it somewhere? Is it upstairs? It's going to be upstairs, isn't it? I have a funny feeling. Yep, it's upstairs. Let's go. Or maybe it's in the bathroom. Nope. Let's go upstairs. I'm not sure why the feather would have ended up all the way upstairs, but I would have put it against them. It is about 2.30 now, so we're making a lot of progress. I guess I'm a little hungry. Mm. Okay, it's been a month. How has the rooftop progressed? That is it fall? Oh no, it's just not being taken care of. That's yikes. This garden is looking gnarly. Is it because it was it supposed to be our responsibility? Oof. What are we supposed to do about that? Yikes. I haven't played for anyone else in years. That was a good night. You played? For who? So far, Ryan is the only one that uses this. Maybe I should just gift it to him. Makes sense. Oh man, they were so pretty. Ugh, you need a lot of help, don't you? We can get Riley to help, maybe. Or Eleanor. Ask for their help. Okay. Well, it's better than nothing. I suppose. <gasps> Bird! Look, man. If you want to live here, you need to do your own dishes. <laughs> it's kind of funny. Okay, no sign of a feather. I think. Yep, no feather. Damn it. Okay, let's go back down. Ah. It can't be. Is it in the bar? Do we leave it in the bar? Am I dumb? Did I see it? Is it seriously just in the room? And I can't find it. I was gonna... No, I've checked everything. It's not there. It's can't... It's not here. Music stuff. Okay, sure, maybe it's there somewhere. Sugar pie rod. No, no, not gonna listen. Fever. There it is. <sighs> Wait. Is that the feather, or is that, is that just a random feather? Okay, no, it's the feather. Nice. Alex the Bard, ready to serve. Time to head out. <laughs> okay, not sure life is happening. Ethan's not into it. Shit, sounds like his dad is picking up in a few hours, too. Ooh, uh oh, oh. Uh, any time tonight? Oh, they've, they're, they've already been flirting, man. I see. Yes, I have some ideas. Oh, dear. By the way, you're genuinely great. You have a gorgeous voice. Okay. Yep. Def. SOS. SOS. Uh, you guys are killing me. The plan is to go distract, distract. Let's see. Mac? 
Oh, Mac. Huh. Thanks for the help, Chen. Just remember, I never told you anything. I risked more than that, than just my job to talk to you. I hear Mac. Don't worry. Get some sleep. You see your said and done. Understandable. Okay, okay, let's go. Here we have a large LARP to attend to. Is there a new note? Hold on. One day, I'll stop being a freeloader. For now, I'm just grateful. I appreciate your effort to offer to start paying rent. Take a few months to fill your piggy bank first, then we can talk. Jet is too nice, man. Also, I hope we're feeding, feeding the fish. The fish is just standing there, swimming there. All the time. We never put attention to them. I wonder if it has a name. I don't wonder if it'll be caught if it'll be a focus at all. I don't I think yeah, I think it does suit her. It suits Alex. As I'm pretty sure there is the pattern of every one of them has a spirit animal. Uh Chloe was the raven, Max was the the doe. The two brothers were wolves. Ethan. Hello, man. How are you doing? Oh, careful. Hey. hey. I don't need, like, cheering up or whatever. Okay. So. Maybe this wasn't the most subtle idea, but... Do it for Gabe? Gabe was so excited to LARP with you. I bet he'd really want you to do it. I do want to do this. It's just... Just? <sighs> okay. Everyone's been working so hard. And if I'm not happy, they'll all be disappointed. That's a fair point. Well, how do you do that? How do you solve that? Oh, and it's raining Must outside. Must be weird having a bunch of adults pressuring you to dress up in a costume and act like you're having fun. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Especially my mom. She always looks so... Sad. Cause I'm like bummed out. But I can't just pretend. Then don't pretend. Then don't. So don't pretend. Ooh. Just be yourself. That is one heck of a reflection. Or yourself with a foam sword and a funny hat. What sort of reflection but is that? What if I'm still, you know, not having fun? Then don't. Yeah. That's fine too. It's okay. No one will be disappointed in you for being you. Yeah. All right. Look at that. But I don't want to do it alone. You have to help me. As your trusty bard, it would be my honor. Let's go, baby. Man, I've never played, I've never LARPed, I've never played D&D. But I already imagine, I already know the kind of character I would love to play as. This is gonna be great. Theodore, the monster slayer. Thanks to the gods and all the heavens you've come. <laughs> He's the king. I am in desperate need of a great hero. Could you be the one? Please tell me of your exploits. <laughs> uh, there's a bunch of stuff. Maybe my bard can sing something about me. <laughs> oh, okay. Sure. Horde of ogres. A horde of ogres. That's a lot. Thanor slew them with a single shot. My goodness. So, you must be Thanor's bard, Alwyn, whose songs have magical powers. Indeed. It sounds like you are exactly the heroes I need. 
My name is King Tabor. I'm the so glad. The of monsters has come upon my kingdom. Horrible creatures stalk the streets. Mm -hmm. My people live in constant fear. But there's hope. An ancient prophecy describes three mysterious gems known as soul jewels that can save us all. I need you to go search the kingdom, survive whatever's out there, and bring me back those jewels. Do you understand? I. Yeah. Yes. Good. Then you must go now. My people are counting on you. I'm so glad they're just going. They're going with it. I love it. Should we start with the main road? They're in. Okay. They're completely in character. I love it so much. Time to find some jewels. Oh, just, just hold on, even. Reminder, we are open. We know a lot of you have floral needs in the ramp up to the Spring Festival, so despite the event in, on Main Street, we'll be maintaining business hours until 5 p.m. today. Attention, monster hunters. This appears to be the result of some sort of extra-dimensional rift opening up and spilling other universe's floors into our world. The Magpie Emporium will investigate. I'm glad you're having fun, honey. The Magpie Emporium arrived in the night, transforming an empty storefront into a fully stocked magic supply shop. Mortal residents are encouraged to come by and produce their wares. Character so sheet. Okay. So we pro we should probably look up at Feanor, just in case. Warrior, let's see. Magic effect, shield of courage, protects Feanor from next attack. For Feanor, the monster slayer, is the most famous hero of the Adderway Peninsula. Even a smallest child knows how he once fed Fell the valley bear with empty hands and hurled a spear into the breast of Rave mid-flight. Entire cities have been saved from the scourge of darkness. Thanks to Feanor's unrivaled strength. And the map. Okay, so we are... Where are we? I don't know. His Majesty... Okay, His Majesty Summer Castle. Uh, Dire Wolf Den. That's oh, just... Oh, you're seriously Alwyn? Don't you recognize me? Jeez. Oh. Yeah, of course. Um, it's been a long time since Carneris. Nice. Exactly. Those were good times, huh? Except for the spiders. Yeah. <laughs> Come on. Ooh, a scroll. Oh, I love the music already. Is that a scroll of paper? Scroll of Healing restores you and your allies to full health, removes all negative status effects, poison, stun, etc. May only be used once. Nice. What is that? It's a magic scroll we can use in fights. Oh, awesome. We should find as many as we can. An NPC. Are you an NPC? No, you are not an NPC. Eh. Are, they, are there more? Please tell me there's more. Is there more? There's gotta be more. I'm looking for the UI. <laughs> Just looking for around the environment before we actually hit the main... Hold on, hold on, man. Hold on, hold on. Hold on, Feanor. Let me just check our surroundings. As your humble bard. I can only... Oh, sorry. Okay, nope. Where is His Majesty's Summer Castle? Where'd it go? Actually, can we still talk to him? No, <laughs> he's happy. Alex really saved the day. Gabe would be proud. Thanks, Jed. Please find the three jewels. Time is of the essence. <laughs> right. Yes, sir. We're on it. Okay, let's go, Fenor. Let's go. <gasps> the werewolf. Okay. It's a wolf. A dire wolf. Oh. oh shit, what do we do? I think we have to fight it. Okay, how do we fight? Let's get it on. Oh, this is so fun. No way. Yes! Oh my god. Okay, Ethan, go first. Attack. Uh, so let's do... Okay, Alex health, oh, Ethan health is 10. Two damage. Two damage. Okay, let's do the math. 
Alex, attack. Untuned cord. Untuned cord. <laughs> One damage. Oh, my ears. And then it's his turn. Two damage. Okay, okay. I know this game. I know this game. Magic. Shield of courage. Shield of courage! Wait. Oh, no, 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 no. Stirring him. Double Thanor's next attack. Feck. I should have. Protected by Shield of Courage. Nice. Okay, your next attack is going to be. A burning Blade. Burning Blade! Two damage, <clears throat> and you're on fire for the next two turns. Nice. Hell yeah! Turn based RPG. Oh, Ryan. <laughs> Ryan. <laughs> oh, he's, he's so nice. He's so cute. Oh, cool. I learned a magic attack. <laughs> One damage to allies? Better be nice to Thanor. New skill acquired. Class warrior. Skill fire blast. Type magic. Effect 3 damage to enemies. 3 damage to enemies, 1 damage to allies. Ooh. Is that worth it? <laughs> okay. Let's just keep it in handy. 3 damage to Let's enemies, 1 to allies. Bye, Ryan. What do you think this key is for? Okay. Dire Wolf. Oh. He's. <laughs> okay. Riley. I should probably drop in on Riley and thank her in person. It's okay. Thank you so much. Uh, uh. Okay. Um, well, you deserve to choose Typhons. Typh Typhons obviously hiding something. Max still scared to death of them. Anyway, oh, did did he did she tell? Oh, she told. 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 Oh my God. Okay, she told. Okay, he's also very happy. This is actually really fun. I'm glad, know, right? <laughs> annoy, 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 annoy. How do we know for sure it's dead? Should we tickle it? <laughs> Stop it. Be serious. Of course, of course. Yes, Feynor. Okay, is there anything here, just in case? Okay, nothing, nothing. But it's a very cool environment though. Oh, this place is perfect for LARPing. Tick. Scroll of Nimbleness, plus one dodge. You and your allies will dodge the next attack. May only be used once. Nice. Found a scroll? Yeah. Cool, cool, cool. Let's see, anything here of use? Just in case. The scrolls could be anywhere. Oh! Looks like the Black Lantern is part of the LARP. Twosome. For within that tower, I can't remember the last time I had this much fun. That makes two of us. Riddle. Hey, let's hear your riddle. There are three, it is said. Heroes long dead, fashioned into soul jewels, blue, violet, red. What are their names? Do not be misled. How are we supposed to know that? Huh. Maybe we can look for some clues. Yeah, let's go back. We'll come back to you. Um, let's see. I'm guessing we didn't miss anything. That's the park area. The tavern. No way. <gasps> Blood. Oh. What's that about? Oh no. I just haven't slept. You know? Every time I close my eyes, my brain pulls up all these thoughts. These regrets. So I just lie there, crying and feeling like a horrible person. Oh no. You mentioned regrets. Can you drill down on that? What is it that you regret? I don't know. 
I'm not sure of anything right now. Oof. I don't think that's... Okay, let's go back to the LARP. <laughs> I'm so sorry. Enter. Wanna look in here? Yeah. Let's go in. Goldweather's Tavern. Nice. I'm I'm actually kind of having fun. If LARPs were like this, even though it, uh, I've seen or um a lot of the LARPs I've seen in real life, as if I've been to LARPs in real life, the ones I see in Hollywood stuff, it's always so high quality budget, high pro um everything, there's costumes and props, uh, it's completely a tier. But honestly, just this is so fun already. I love it. I love it. I just wish this was more common or something. Ooh. By Jove. What has happened? What happened here? Ducky. Fellow survivors, I see. Oh, no. <laughs> Are you hurt? Are you hurt? <laughs> Hardly my first monster attack. I know an escape trick or two. This is so nice. This is so, so cute. Do you know what this key is for? Belong to Barry, the tavern keeper. That's his leg over there. Oh. Oof. So, if you want to try all of the locks, I'm sure he won't stop you. It's so nice that he's playing an NPC. Let's see what we can find around here. Let's see. He's also happy. I'm a genius for convincing Steph that my character should be alone behind the bar. All the drinks I want. Hmm. Not sure how I feel about that. It's so sweet of Ducky to participate in this. Yes? Above that ale. I see you've poured yourself some ale. Ned will hear of this. <laughs> I heard Barry the Tavern Keeper has a son. Ned is very observant. <laughs> so Barry's like a hundred years old? How did you survive? How did you survive the attack? Well, I'm not proud of it, but I tripped an elderly woman. Okay. She had it coming. Stingy dishwench. <laughs> All right. I'll take it. We're on a quest. Want to tell them about our quest? We're on a quest to end the age of monsters. So you? Won't have to live in fear anymore. Are you now? Let me give you something that you may find useful. Ooh. Thanks. I'm gonna go ahead and guess we'll be meeting a snake. Okay. Ophidian chime. Type instrument requires bard. Here. Snakes within hearing must fall asleep. Oh, okay. Gotcha. Gotcha. New dialogue unlocked. We're gonna keep looking around. Wait. Good luck. But there's a new dialogue. Okay. okay. I think I checked all the compartments. Tankards. Okay, we don't need um chest. Someone knows how to keep Thanor busy. Yep. Advertisements. House Bard. Sorry, Steph. Alwyn is pretty <laughs> happy with her current gig. Seeking house bar to entertain at dinner stances, beheading, etc. Must be witty, perceptive, generous of heart, black hair, preferred, cute smile, plus excellent compensation. All, all sorts for sale. See you in the blacksmith. Nice. <laughs> Steph is so good about, with this. Gabe's plaque. Ooh, a coin. Tick. 
That's gonna come in handy, I think. That was meant to be there. Anything here? Anything here? Sheet music. Ooh, Steph. Is this you? What happened to the rest of the music? New skill acquired. Class bard. Skill hypnotic fugue. Okay. Let's see. What else? What else? What else? Oh. The 13th quinquennial meeting of the Daegu Biscuit Boys is hereby called to order. Huh. I'm sorry to announce that all six of us remain upright and above uh, ground. Uh, first point of order. Ducky, if you had to guess, though, about how much longer are you fixing to live? <laughs> Just long enough to collect, Gordon, and not a minute longer. I'll crawl graveward with your shares clutched in my stiffening fingers. You mark my words. Oh, here scroll. we go. This probably has the answer to that riddle. Okay, Belin. Okay, the Legend of the Soul Jewels. Let's see. Belin, Nira, and Desis. Long ago, it is said, when unspeakable terrors have reigned, even in the light, daylight, four heroes faced the Great Shadow on the Killian shores. For days, the battle raged, until the powers of the Great Shadow overwhelmed the four heroes, pushing them to the brink of death. Their among waves strained with blood, three of the heroes gave their lives calling upon an ancient spell that pulled the souls from their bodies and fashioned them into three stones of immeasurable power. From Nira, the berserker, strong, strongest of the four, came the soul ruby. From Desis, the cleric, weaver of stories, came the soul sapphire. From Belin, the illusionist, keeper of the old books, came the soul amethyst. With all three soul jewels in hand, the fourth hero took up their sword and struck down a great shadow, piercing it with light. Then, weary and bloody from the battle, the fourth hero hid the jewels away and wandered into the deep wilds of Ruin, never to be seen again. Deep wilds. Okay, let me just... Um, Nira, Berserker, Ruby. Nira, Berserker, Ruby. This is Cleric, Soul, Saf Sapphire, Sapphire. This is Sapphire, Cleric. Belin, Illusionist, Amethyst. Okay. I'm gonna forget this. This is sapphire. This is blue. Berlin, Amethyst. Berlin, Mira, this is. Don't forget, please. I'm gonna forget. I'm pretty sure. Oh, that's gonna Steph definitely. Out of everything, she's amazing at this. Nice, nice, nice letter. Guess Lawrence is gonna need a new business advisor. Man, she really went all out. Let's see. Whoa, what did I see? Wanted poster. This kingdom has serious problems. Nice. Bloody luck. Ugh, rough day for Barry the Tavern Keeper. Music box, unlock. Ooh, that's a very nice music box. Thanor! Did you see this? That's got to be it! Nice. It's one of the jewels! Yes. Oh, sorry. We got the amethyst. So that's the B one. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. And the gnome is not gonna do anything. Down. Two to go. That wasn't so bad, right? Now I feel more confident we can find the others. I was having such a quiet morning. I was having such a quiet morning. Oh. Alex is right. But I was just trying to have a little fun. Gotta pace out that fun, Ducky. For your own good. I was having such a quiet morning. Okay. Well, it's. For your own good, man. Should we go upstairs? Okay, we can't go upstairs. Rolling pin. I actually feel bad for that person. If there was a monster, and you only had your guitar, would you smash their head with it? Yeah. Depends. Yes. Of course I would. Are you sure? Absolutely. Yes. 
We're gonna have to deal with this, aren't we? Take heed. He is. It is believed that a swamp troll has taken residence below the eastern bridge. Use extreme caution when crossing. Did or better yet, did you see this warning? Don't. Bye, Taki. That was fun. That was fun. I think we got everything in the tavern. So, I'm going to leave this part here. That was so much fun. I honestly, I honestly think I'll be spending too much time on this LARP section. Because I think there's going to be a lot of Easter eggs. A lot of fun stuff that I cannot miss for the life of me. This, this is only like part one of chapter three. I wonder if chapter 3 is actually going to take longer than the other chapters because of just how many easter eggs are available but and not, not easter eggs just the clues stuff check out what i found in that chest Ooh, scroll of nimbleness plus one dodge you and your allies will dodge the next attack You'll only be used once nice nice work thanor nice okay alex health is 8 10. Um, okay. Tab phone. Can someone please explain why everyone on Main Street is dressed like a Renaissance- <laughs> Mike. Renaissance festival threw up on them. The Age of Monsters have descended upon our fair Hamlet. This is exactly what I'm talking about. This is not, sir. To those who would tell you to abandon hope, for the great hero Fainor has arrived at our gates. What does this mean? I just wanted to get some ice cream. Oh, <laughs> Ryan, is that you? God, there was just some so fun. really interesting stuff in there. Yep. So, I'm going to leave that there. Thank you so much for watching. This has been like, I know I'm, I've been getting quieter and quieter, but this has legitimately been the f most fun episode so far. Like, I didn't think that Life is Strange could actually tackle something like a. Uh, a turn-based RPG but it did it they did it and it was fun it was good I'm, I'm surprised just as surprised as you are and I'm really excited to continue it I don't know who's going to be the next monster but I'm very happy with how it's turning out Steph did a good job organizing the slurp I feel like I'm talking about them as if they're real people at this point but yeah thanks again and I'll see you guys in the next one